All right, I am standing here in Fairfax County, Virginia, the most populous county in the state of Virginia. In this video, I am gonna be getting into all the pros and cons of living in Fairfax. Definitely subscribe to my channel, and if you're thinking about buying a house in the DC area, I help tons of buyers and sellers, mostly from my YouTube video. You can always check me at the number below, but let's get right into the video. All right, so I am gonna start off with the biggest pro of living in Fairfax. Now, right now, I'm in this brand new townhome subdivision, and right here, there's all these amazing office buildings, and we're in Herndon, Virginia. So, like, right over there, there's a Whole Foods, then I see a bus stop, and then you can go right down the street and go to the metro system, like, anywhere you wanna go. So, it's all about the location here. And, like, these townhomes here, they are a little bit more expensive, around, like, seven to 800000 so the housing options can be a little bit expensive, but, the location is definitely clear. Like right around the street, there's a Verizon building. Then I'm looking at a Peterson Company building. So if you're getting a job here and you wanna like live close to work, Fairfax is definitely for you. Let's keep getting into the pros and cons of Fairfax County. All right, so as we're out here shooting, I realize one of the biggest cons is the weather. Like yesterday, it was 60. And today it is literally 20 degrees outside. We can barely stand outside to even film. So the weather here gets pretty extreme in the summer. I've said this before in other videos. It gets super hot, but in the winter it can get really cool. Well, we've only had one little tiny snow dusting here, which surprises a lot of my YouTube viewers that move here. Is we just don't get a lot of snow, but it definitely gets cold. But let's keep going on a tour of Fairfax. All right, so let's talk about one of the biggest pros of living here in Fairfax, and that is the shopping. So right behind me is Fair Oaks Mall. They have Cheesecake Factory, Dave & Buster's, pretty much whatever you want. You could also go over to Tyson's Corner and you're gonna have a lot of high-end stores there like Louis Vuitton and Gucci. And like the funny thing is I'm looking over here and there's a Marriott and I've been to a bunch of weddings over here and then there's office buildings over here. But like the cool thing is, as I'm like looking, right here is Route 50, which you can head towards Reston or wherever you want, but you can also hop on 66, which takes you right into DC or the Vienna Metro. So location is also killer over here as well. Let's get into some more pros of living in Fairfax. All right, let's talk about my favorite subject, housing. And in Fairfax, there's definitely plenty of housing options. Though one of the cons is it gets kind of expensive around here when you're talking housing. If you're looking for like a little bit cheaper housing in Fairfax, I would definitely suggest Centerville, which we've done videos on in the past. But like Reston Town Center is another great area. But the closer you get into DC, typically housing gets a lot more expensive. But you can get a condo in Fairfax for two to 300,000, or you can get a high rise condo for a million, and you can get a single family starting in like 500,000, or a townhouse for a million dollars, like one of these ones behind us. So the housing, there is definitely plenty of options there. And if you are thinking about buying a home in the area, text me at the number below. Me and my team would love to help you. I help tons of YouTube viewers. That's where most of my business comes from. But let's keep going over the pros and cons of Fairfax. <music> All right, one of the huge pros of Fairfax is, of course, the job market. This has got to be one of the best job markets in the country. I have a ton of clients who actually have moved away only to move back. And I had a couple YouTube viewers move away from Fairfax to go to Florida, and they decided to move back because they got another job here. And the salaries are typically very high as well. So the job market here is definitely killer. But again, what comes with that is a con because then the cost of living here can get really expensive, which is probably one of the biggest cons as well to live in and Fairfax, but let's keep going over the pros and cons of Fairfax. All 
All right, so one other thing I mentioned about Fairfax is one of the few parts of Northern Virginia where you don't actually really need a car because you can Uber, take public transportation, hop on the Metro as well, which is a huge pro. But I hope you guys enjoyed my video. As always, subscribe to my channel. And if you're thinking about buying or selling, shoot me an email, Chris Colgan at colganteam.com. I would love to help you. Like I help tons of my YouTube viewers and definitely subscribe. I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers. So as always, I will see you at the top or from the top of Fairfax, Virginia. Thanks for watching.